Well, school board meetings can oftentimes be uneventful, but the one that unfolded in Panama City, Florida yesterday turned deadly when a man pulled a gun and opened fire. Now, before we start this, we want to show you and warn you that the video you're going to see and what you're about to hear can be very disturbing to you and your family, especially on a Wednesday morning. Here's Andy Rose with what happened. But why? If this, is, this isn't worth it. This is a problem. Please don't. Please don't. Please. Heart-stopping moments for Bay District School Board members in Panama City, Florida Tuesday. Amazingly, no one was hurt except the gunman, 56-year-old Clay Duke. Police say he died after shooting himself. In the moments leading up to the shooting, news cameras were rolling as they normally do during school board meetings. Duke stood up and spray-painted a red circle and a V, then told everyone except six board members to get out. You may leave, you may leave. Being he told you when he can leave. Moments later, a board member tried unsuccessfully to knock the gun out of Duke's hand with her purse, while board members yelled for her to stop. No, Ginger. Ginger, no. The superintendent, who you heard trying to reason with Duke, recounted the terrifying ordeal. When he turned around with that gun, you could see in his eyes that, um, you know, he had he just had that look. You knew that he, he had something in mind he was going to do, and it was not going to end well. Authorities now trying to determine what caused Clay Duke to go on a shooting spree, which ultimately ended with his own death. Andy Rose, ABC2 News.